we are team 14 uh, we present uh, netboot over ic so what the project does is you could boot a physical machine or a virtual machine from a canister so that's the overall project the use case is that we present a canister as a block device to a vm and once we virtualize at that uh, lowest level if anything running inside the vm can benefit from storage which is running on the ic so your boot drive itself can be encrypted by dm and then uh, you could pretty much anything which goes inside the vm is now backed by canister storage uh the next thing is that the boot infrastructure is now decentralized and unstoppable that is uh, in your it infrastructure you can take out the nfs server and the tftp server which is required for booting booting uh, machines and actually put it on the ic and take advantage of all the fault tolerant features of the ic other use case would be like you can use it for uh, failover that is uh, you can have a zookeeper service which is running in a data center and storing its actual data on the ic if the data center goes down the vm can be booted in another data center and then have access to all the application data uh, for the zookeeper drive yeah and then this is also a proof of concept for us to for talking to the ic over legacy protocols like uh, tftp and uh, dhcp so it's very similar to one of the uh, github presentation we had which is exposing ic over the git protocol okay so those are the use cases uh quickly go to the design so the design is uh, you have the leg legacy infrastructure on the right hand side and uh, what we built on the left hand side so you have a vm uh, which boots uh, over pixie pixie is a pre boot execution environment it's a bias environment which lets you get an ip and a location of the boot p server so pixie gets those from the underlying os hypervisor uh, we use the koemu network to set up the boot p such that it points to our tftp server which runs on the same hypervisor once we have that uh, uh once we intercept the calls by the tftp server what we did is we wrote an uh, ic agent which instead of talking to the file system gets the boot data from a canister so the so we have a canister which uh, exposes a file system like interface where each file is addressed by its file name and then you can fetch individual sectors for that file and then we have this uh, small uploader component which can upload any bootloader onto a canister so essentially pixie linux.0 is the main bootloader once we get access to pixie linux.0 you pretty much can boot into any operating system that you want yeah so all the gray stuff is existing infrastructure and integration the blue stuff is something which we wrote so this is the canister interface and then we can go to the demo uh, okay how do i okay okay so the demo would be like we will uh, install we would boot into a uh, uh, installer image for linux okay so on the right uh, i have the tftp server which is uh, exposing tftp over the standard port t69 uh, so i started the tftp server on the other window i have uh, uh, the canister which is already hosting the uh, pre boot image uh, if you can uh, look at the listing of the files that the canister host it's just the pre boot all the files required to boot a vm and then here we start a vm which is pre configured to boot over uh, uh tftp okay so hopefully this vm boots hey for us we are at time yep. so if you could wrap up the demo um that would be great thank you yeah so it will just boot up in like 5 uh, to 10 seconds
So you can see the actual VM installer booted from TFTP is talk to the canister and you have your boot screen and then of course you can do anything that you feel like doing in the VM. Yeah, so that's it from us. Uh, thank you.